there were golden moments with the Gophers. And other times where he was the Sky Yuma scapegoat. But Mitch Leidner took it one step at a time on the ultimate ride in college football. I was able to learn a lot about myself and um, been through a lot of different forms of adversity throughout my career. And the, I feel like the way I've been able to handle it and learn from those different situations has made me into a better person today. A year ago, he was projected as a first round NFL draft pick. And when that came out in May or whatever it was, I could, I was still barely walking normal on my foot. And I was like, I got a long way to go if I'm gonna get to this level. But here and now, and healthy, it is time for that next level. Before making the unknown move to the NFL, Leidner is staying in a familiar place. He's home in Minnesota and getting ready with quarterback trainer Grant Norley. I would say he's a grinder. He's a guy that's not going to let anything get in his way. He went through a lot of hard times and really has come out on the other end still hungry and, and ready to get after it. In his preparations, Mitch has only one speed. So we have to slow him down a little bit. You know, it's like, hey, bud, we got we to gotta pull this back a little bit. And that go-go lifestyle just brought Leidner to the NFL Combine, where he met with 20 teams already. There are pro potential questions about his ability in games. Obviously, my statistics this year weren't great. Everybody knows that, but um, they love to be able to see me on film, anticipate throws, get through my progressions, do little things like that. But at six foot three, 226 pounds, his size is solid NFL material. That said, one thing is also certain. Teams only see him play one position. No team is considering you as anything but a quarterback. No, I haven't heard anything. I've talked to a lot of teams and only one of them, only one scout mentioned it. I've talked to their team too as a quarterback coach and never even mentioned it. And if you have your doubts, don't worry. Oh. Leidner's heard those naysayers before. I don't really care what, what anyone says. The only thing he will be listening for, his name on draft night. As long as I, I can get a team who, who believes in me, who, who uh, wants to give me an opportunity, I'll go in there and, and work as hard as I can. I want to be the best NFL quarterback I can be because because that's just what I want to do. And I'm going to work extremely hard, and I'm not going to let anyone bring me down from that dream. Hobie Artigue, Fox 9.